Welcome back to The Coach's Show. I'm your host, Jay Russell, joined along with Buffalo's quarterback, Jesse Cervantes. What's going on, man? What's going on? I'm just hanging out on The Coach's Show, Same. man. Me too. You chilling? All right. <laughs> All right, Jesse, man, uh, you had some clutch football you played, man, in the fourth quarter, man. Can you just talk about, uh, you know, you sco scored two touchdowns near the end of the fourth quarter. Like, what was going through your mind? I mean, not I was just doing whatever I can to get my team back in the game, give our chance, give ourselves a chance to win. That's pretty much all I was going through my head. I know. Was it kind of like difficult to kind of just get focused to say like, you know what, we're down? And uh, yeah, it was. It was. It was kind of hard, but you know, I had to. I had to do it for my team. I heard you had to man up, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> all right? So I know you guys. After you guys scored the second touchdown, you guys were still down by two points. You yes. needed a two point conversion, and I know your man Ryan. Uh, did you guys talk about before that two-point conversion play came well, through? Well, actually, before, right when we scored, I told them, like, when we score, we need this two-point conversion because those two points are critical. And I told them, I was like, whatever you got to do to get open in the end zone, I'm going to hit you. And sure enough, I found them connected with it. So what was going through your head when your man caught it? Oh, I mean, that was excitement. I mean, that's all, that's all you can go through your head. I mean, you just tied the game, came back. So... You know, you guys did tie the game, but then in overtime, as we know, you guys did not win this game. But just like I was speaking with Coach Phillips, you know, losses are, you know, great teachers. So what positives can you take away from this game? I, I, think, it, I think it's a good wake-up call for us. I mean, it, I mean, we can get ourselves focused and uh, get ourselves focused on the goals and then take it week by week, and then and at the end of the season, we'll get there. Okay. And so you guys have a – I know you guys are hungry, man, because uh, you guys have been riding a long win streak, but you guys have a Ozona coming up next. Oh, yeah. So can you just talk about, man, you know, what can you expect to see – what can we expect to see from the Buffaloes against Ozona next week? Uh, back to our fast-paced offense and the same shutout defense we've had all year. Speaking about shutouts, everyone at home, the defense put up five shutouts this season, so these boys don't play around. <laughs> <laughs> over there yeah. and uh, for it's that bad. But uh, outside of football, man, what are some of your hobbies that you like to do? Uh, well, I like, to, I like to play disc golf. I like to hang out with friends and eat 24-7. So. Oh, okay. Cool, cool. So, you know, we're going to get into some more fun questions, man. Who's your celebrity crush? Celebrity crush? Jennifer Aniston. Jennifer Anderson. That's, that's, that's my crush. So you watch a couple of episodes of Friends, I'm guessing. Oh, right? yeah. Okay. <laughs> I'm not mad at you. She, she's, she's a nice she's, Yeah, she's a good-looking woman. Right. Okay, right. You can say it respectfully. You'll be yeah. okay. So we were talking this week over at Mike Up, man, and you said uh, Coach Phillips walks around. He's got a nickname there. Everybody calls him. Oh, J. Phil, yeah. J. Phil. That's his nickname around around Forsan. Forsan. So next time I'm in Forsan, if I'm just like, hey, J. Phil, he'll say, what's yeah. up to me? What's up? What's up, Jay? <laughs> He will. Okay, man. Well, yo, good luck versus Ozona this week, man. I know it's going to be a good game, so good luck next week. Thanks for coming on the show. Thank too, you. Forsen went 4-7 four and seven last year and 2-2 two and two in district, finishing as a bi-district finalist. After a week one loss to Kahoma, the Buffaloes have been on a mission. I caught up with head coach Jason Phillips this week for Mike.